This week on Hallway Sports Network's Off the Track, we'll be speaking with the skaters of Texas Outlaws Roller Derby. Welcome back to Sports Network's Off the Track. You're surely Tony Hall. Today we're speaking with Hermione Painter, yet again. <laughs> now, we've already we've already gone into the whole uh, how you got your name right, thing. Right. So, so um, as far as any any updates, you got a you got your team that you're on this time around. Or? Right, right. Um, yeah. Last month I skated with the Homicidal Housewives. Okay. Um, but this month they're not playing, so okay. I got drafted to the Bayside Bombshells. Bayside Bombshells, okay. Mm -hmm. So you'd be proudly wearing purple That's this That's right, day. right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, now as far as the, the skaters in the, in, the, in the bombshells that you had a chance to skate with, uh, anything to look forward to? Or? Um, yeah, actually, uh, Bangarang is on the Bayside Bombshells. Okay. And um, she's always been on the opposing team, so I'm really looking forward <laughs> to actually skating with her. Yeah. Uh, I told her how great she is. and. Um, how every time she's jamming, I look back and I'm like, oh, it's bangering. And so this time I'll, I'll be excited that she's jamming on my team. Yeah, so. unfortunately not hitting anybody. That's right, that's right. <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I know there's a lot of heavy hitters on the on the Outlaws. I know, I know, especially from the last game. Right. Yeah, we had Killstoy was really knocking people out. Oh, yeah, yeah. definitely. <laughs> we all aspire to be a little like Killstoy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. Now, um, now, of course, um, you're still working blocker. Yes. Yeah, uh, mm -hmm. what was that, blocker one? Or uh, blocker one, mm -hmm. and last, yeah. but last game, I did play the second position as well. Oh, so. okay, yeah. What does actually, what does two do as opposed to one or three? Um, one is basically on the inside line, mm -hmm. that's their job, they're holding that line, making sure yeah. the jammer doesn't get through. In the position two, there's a little more lateral movement, mm -hmm. you need to stay with your partner on the one, that blocker one. Make sure that jammer doesn't get through there, mm -hmm. and then also kind of go in between that one and the third. And if the jammer comes by, you push them to the outside line. Oh, so. okay. So, so what you're saying is like, like you're right in the middle of the two other right. blockers. So you exactly. Can go side kinda to side. Kind of hold that middle yeah. ground, and mm -hmm. uh, you know, if the position three gets you know ahead or behind, you just if the jammer's coming, you make sure you sweep them out to the outside. Yeah, I noticed in the last game there was a lot of putting putting the jammer in the box per se. You know? Right. Yeah. Right. So I, I, I was like, that was like a like an amazing move where you actually stopped. Right, right. A jammer. Exactly. In the tracks exactly. And, yeah. Build a wall. So, <laughs> yes, definitely. Yeah, there was there was a lot of that going on. I know it yeah. was a, it was a Skate Charmer vert with uh, I think it was Skate Charmer with Riot at one point. Mm -hmm. and, yes. And, yeah. Yes. So it was it was really it was really a crazy crazy to see that it was like almost like almost every other jam or something like that when right. got together. Right. Right. Like crazy. Yes. Yeah. Great to watch. <laughs> <laughs> now now um, have you ever been able to successfully block as far as uh, um, some really good jammers in there. Um, there are some really good jammers. Mm -hmm. um, last time we spoke, actually, Pink Shrapnel right, was right. Uh, one of my concerns, and she was really fast. And mm -hmm. it was one of those things where I would turn, and oh, she's still back there. And yeah. then I would turn again, and she was going past. Yeah, because I know she, so. she has a tendency, she can go real low. She can, yeah. yeah. She's very thin and fast on her skates, but this time she'll also be on my team, so I'm excited oh, about okay. that. But um, <laughs> yeah. as far as building a wall, that's really the best way to, to block, and, mm -hmm. and I've gotten some hits where I actually knocked the jammer out. Mm -hmm. One time I got a penalty, because <laughs> it was an illegal block, yeah. but I blocked her, I got her out of the out of the um, line, so I felt like I was successful. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was have, worth the penalty. Yeah, did you get any retribution for that? Uh, no, nah, no. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't, actually. <laughs> so. now, uh, now, of course, um, we talked about the bombshells. Now, um, right. now, who are you going up against this time around? For it's going to be the, the, the Las Diablas mm -hmm. and, um, let's see, I know, oh, I don't even know who's on the other team. Queen mm -hmm. is going to be on the other team. Um, 
I'm, I really don't know. <laughs> Do you have any idea? <laughs> I don't think we've gotten that far you yet. You haven't gotten that yeah. far. Yeah. Um, oh, Jackie Breakart will be okay. on the Diablo. Mm -hmm. So she's a, she's a really good skater too, mm -hmm. um, a good jammer. So, um, but it's fun. I haven't really had a good chance to look at their rosters. They just announced them last Thursday. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Okay. So, so we'll be looking looking to see what what happens on the 22nd. Yes. Right. Yeah. Right. Very right. excited. Right. Okay. Now, um, as far as uh, I was just talking with Wrecker about, um, you know, life kind of getting in the way sometimes, you know, right. obligations, things like that. Have you had any kind of problems with uh, being able to work, you know, kind of life into derby? That's kind of the big thing that skaters talk right. about nowadays. It's kind of um, when you get into derby, it just kind of consumes everything, yeah. consumes your yeah. life because. It's so much fun, and you just kind of want to just throw your everything into it. But um, I don't know. I feel like I have a good balance. I'm a school teacher, um, so that takes up a lot of time. Yeah. But yeah. then um, I just really make derby a priority, also because it is so much fun. It's a great stress reliever, mm -hmm. and I just I just love it. So, um, but I, th I think you have to you know find a balance and not go to all the derby events <laughs> right. yeah, because it's easy to get wrapped up in right that. you know you got world cup and you got right you gotta, right <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot yeah. going on in the world of derby so mm -hmm. yeah. yeah yeah um well as far as uh, the future looking forward to um you know can you see uh, yourself in a few years getting into a good spot in derby and i, I think so yeah. yeah it's something i really want to pursue at this point i'm um, you know, I, I've made a lot of progress. I have only been skating for about six months, mm -hmm. um, but I really want to be really good, and mm -hmm. so I just keep persisting. and And it's hard, you know. I get frustrated. Um, you know, it's just it's just difficult. I've never been very athletic. Yeah. So it's something that I just have to keep telling myself. If I just stay at it, I'll get better, mm -hmm. and um, and it'll pay off. So it's something I really do want to do for the long term. Okay. I love yeah. it. Yeah. And, uh, and of course, of course, in the short time that you've been you've been doing it, it has been paying off. Then. Right. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> All right. Any any words for anybody who might be still on the fence about uh, joining a league? Um, just do it. Anybody can do it. I know. Um, when I first started. I could barely move on skates, and uh, everyone is so encouraging, and they really teach you all the skills that you need. Mm -hmm. And um, it's just, it's a lot of fun. It's a great workout, and it's a great family atmosphere. So um, mm -hmm. you should do it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we'll be looking forward to that game coming up on Sunday, February 22nd at Alvin Skating Party uh, in Alvin, Texas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it'll be the uh, Los Diablos versus Bayside Bombshells. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be quite a game. Yes, it is.